Pendleton now where police are investigating two Drano bombs that were planted on porches on two different homes in that town. One homeowner put up security camera video of a suspect committing that crime on Facebook. That tactic apparently worked in tracking down suspects connected to those crimes. RTV6's Derek Thomas has that story. This young man sneaks up onto the porch of a house on Yellow Brick Road. He shakes the bottle up and quickly slips away. A few seconds later, the chemical reaction going on inside the bottle makes it expand and it explodes. Police say since this video was placed on Facebook, they have identified five suspects. Neighbors weighed in on what those suspects might have been thinking. Just some stupid teenagers not really understanding the consequences of what could happen. How important is it that they be caught? I think it's pretty important. I wouldn't want it to go off with and my kids be around. The security cameras were indispensable in solving this crime. Neighbors commented on what should happen to the perpetrators. Put them through the system, unfortunately. I don't know what else you could do. Uh -huh. I know what I would do if they were my child. I hope you do. <laughs> Treat them like they were in prison. <laughs> Take everything. A Drano bomb was also brought to this house on Congress Drive that same day. There was minimal damage and no one was injured in either incident. Police have identified five juveniles involved in this incident. They say arrests are pending. In Pendleton, Derek Thomas, RTV6. Police are also warning, if you find a suspicious device near your house or on your porch, do not pick it up. Always call them and have them check it out first.